Hey guys, welcome back to another season of NHL news slash rumors. In this series, we talk about um, the newest NHL game regarding news and rumors when it comes down to the game and everything about it. So today we're going to talk about what's coming in August, September, and then obviously at the end of September, what's happening there. So in late August, so probably in the next couple of days, we're going to see gameplay of NHL 25. And then in September, early mid-September, we're going to get a presentation and then, or a presentation and franchise mode. We're going to take a look at those in early mid-September. And then late September, um, we have the Brothers Face-Off and Hockey Ultimate Team. And then on September 27th, we have Early Access Launch. So they're probably going to send out a thing where you can actually, what you did before in previous years is to go up, sign in with your EA account, and then choose what platform you want to play on, either PlayStation or Xbox, and they'll send you a code for the early access. And regarding the early access, you cannot record, can't take screenshots and all that stuff, but people still do anyways, but those people will get banned pretty damn quick if you guys do that. I highly uh, not recommend it if you actually do that because that just bans your EA account and all that stuff and it's not it's not worth it it's not worth it and another thing i want to talk about that has been shared uh been shared on my discord is from the ea forums i believe and it is um it says i'm very happy to report that reverse hit has been removed from the r3 for nhl 25 and i'll pull up a picture here on the screen all that stuff. So if you actually, actually, if you guys want to keep up to date on any NHL 25 news or even rumors, make sure you guys head over to my Discord. There'll be a link in the description. And uh, you guys can check it out. It's part of the EA Sports News Room um, and everything like that. And also, you can put your wish list in there as well for NHL 25 or even NHL 26 and stuff like that. So there's one thing I really want to talk about that is actually a really good topic to actually talk about because now we have confirmation that's going to be that's going to have three brothers on the cover, and that kind of gives me an idea on the series that I talked about in my NHL 25 wish list, which was two player be a pro or um, like play with a friend be a pro. They kind of have that in the Formula One games where you currently can invite one of your friends to play F1 with you on the same career mode, either on the same team. Or I believe you can actually be on separate teams and then battle out on the circuit. Which is actually a pretty cool idea. I actually kind of like that idea um, when it comes down to it. And I thought of the idea, like, that could work for NHL Be a Pro to have for, like, a really good YouTube series for content creators and live streamers and stuff like that. Because that would be a pretty cool, have like, to have a thing where you guys can, um, you can, like... I already have a couple people in mind here on YouTube to collab with if that actually does come true um, or if it does actually happen. I don't know if it's going to happen this year or happen next year or never happen at all, but I'm always I'm always going to try to push for that. I think it's a really cool idea to have two player be a pro and um, yeah, I'm actually pretty excited for the game um, as well. And I'm not just saying that because I'm part of the EA creator network and stuff like that. I'm actually pretty excited to see what's going to go on with the early access and what they're going to change from early access to the full game because last year with the early access, it was completely different than what we have now, what we have currently, obviously. Um, but usually when these stuff happens or the new NHL game comes out, after a couple months, they change the game. They change the way the game feels after a couple of updates and then the game's not the same anymore as it was before and that kind of that kind of pisses me off a little bit when it comes down to that where they like they say they haven't changed anything like gameplay wise or the feel of it but um a lot of people can recognize the feel or the difference between last like last couple months to the newest update right so but um i would love to see um Two player be a pro and see where the game goes on from early access to the full release. But after the full, yeah, uh, after the full access, early access, and stuff like that, I usually do a video talking about my experience with the early access and all that stuff. So 
make sure you guys stay tuned for that video at the end of September. <laughs> Even though we're just coming up the end of August. So probably next week, we're probably going to see the gameplay video for NHL 25. And hopefully that gives us a better idea how the game will feel and look at the same time. But there's another thing I wanted to talk about. But And uh, finally, the NHL 25 is the second EA game, EA Sports game, just to come to the next generation. And I'm putting that in quotations, like next generation, because we're so far in the Xbox Series X and Series S and PS5 era that it is... The new the new PS5 and the new Xbox is currently the like it's it's the current gen. PS4 and Xbox Xbox One is last generation, and there's going to be no NHL 25 for the Xbox One and PS4, unfortunately. So if you guys haven't got a PS5 or an Xbox Series X or S, maybe you guys look into it and actually get in one. I know Xboxes come on sale quite a lot, and I know I've seen a couple PS5s go on sale, uh, PS5 Slims and stuff like that. I've seen them come on sale uh, once in a while. So if you guys are really into NHL and while you guys want to play the newest version, make sure you guys pick up the newest console just to uh, warn you guys. So you guys go out and buy the game, and it doesn't work for your Xbox One or PS4, That it kind of sucks. It kind of sucks. So... But anyways, those are a couple things I wanted to talk about with NHL 25 so far. There's probably going to be a lot more videos talking about NHL 25 on this channel. So if you guys are interested in that, you guys want to see more of that, make sure you guys smash the like button. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys haven't already. My name is Justin Erprez, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.